Well, it's another week at Bountiful Gardens and we have so many more plants to show you. Come check it out. These are dahlias, and these are one of my favorites here at Bountiful Garden. They're technically perennials, but in New Jersey, they're considered annuals. However, you can go ahead and dig up the tubers to keep them for next year. They're long blooming, go throughout the summer, and perfect for your patio. These are annual salvia, and they are one of the best annuals at attracting hummingbirds and pollinators into your garden. They are also deer and rabbit resistant. Annual ovelias are blooming right now, and they're beautiful. This is Ipomia, commonly called sweet potato vine. It's a vigorous growing annual vine that's ideal in hanging baskets, pots, or even as an accent plant. It comes in all kinds of varieties, as you can see in front of me. One of my favorites is the really dark purple one. We have an abundant supply of decorative grasses and tall dracaena spikes, which are a great way to add a centerpiece to one of your flower planters or some nice textures and colors. These are fuchsia. They attract hummingbirds and insects and are the perfect hanging basket or topiary for your patio this summer. This is verbena, another full sun annual that we have here at Bountiful Garden. They tend to move in a trailing habit, which makes them perfect for both planters and hanging baskets. You can also deadhead them to keep them blooming all summer long. The leaves on these red begonias are gorgeous. This is Calabricoa, also known as Million Bells. They're similar to petunias, but they're less sticky and also don't require deadheading, making them the perfect summer annual. This is Asclepius, commonly called red butterfly weed. It's a tropical, so it's considered an annual in our area, but it will bloom from summer well into the fall. It's deer resistant and an absolute butterfly magnet. These panthers and antenna trees bloom all summer long and will bring a lot of pollinators and hummingbirds love them. We have a wide selection of fig bushes and trees in right now, which are ready to plant in the garden and give you fruits for the season. Our urban vegetable section continues to grow and a lot of these plants are flowering, which means they're ready to start producing vegetables for you. We have a lot of eucalyptus in right now, which is incredibly fragrant. And if you plant it right now and protect it in winter, it can grow into a bush for you and come back year after year. This is Luithia, a perennial that likes both the sun and a little bit of shade. It's perfect for well-draining containers and rock garden. It also has succulent type leaves that a lot of people enjoy. These are Baptisia. They're also known as false indigo. They come in a wide variety of colors and also have a native variety that has vibrant blue blooms. They are drought tolerant and deer resistant. We just got an awesome collection of carnivorous perennials and things like Venus flytraps, sundews, and pitcher plants too. These plants are really unique in the garden, but they do need to be kept very wet, almost like they're in a swamp, so keep an inch of water underneath them, and they want to be in bright sun, and that way you can get these incredible flowers that they put out. This is Lychnis, also known as Ragged Robin. It's a low-maintenance, easy-to-grow perennial. It blooms in mid-spring on compact bushy clumps, and it's also deer resistant. These are catch fly. They are drought tolerant and deer and rabbit resistant. They like part shade and attract hummingbirds and butterflies. This is Jacob's Ladder, a perennial that does really well in part sun to even shady locations and blooms these beautiful blue flowers with yellow centers to them. This is a foam flower. It is a native, shade-loving, perennial ground cover. We have one of New Jersey's most popular flowering perennials, the cat mint. It's great in any yard because it's deer resistant, can handle full sun to part shade, and it attracts tons of pollinators to your yard too. It's also lightly fragrant. Our yarrow is blooming for the summer. This is a perennial with silvery foliage and bright yellow flowers. Works best planted in clumps and planted in full sun, so you can really show off that yellow. 
This is Snowmound Spirea, a drought-tolerant deciduous shrub that we carry here. They get these little white clusters of flowers that bloom through midsummer. They're perfect for mass plantings and also as foundation plants. These are Dutsia. They're a relative of Hydrangea. They love sunny spots and have very fragrant flowers. They are also disease and deer resistant. This is Calacanthus, also known as Sweet Shrub. A great native shrub, it's very versatile, has really great fragrant blossoms, does well in both sun and shade, and tends to bloom late in the spring, usually around June. These are knockout roses. They will bloom for you all summer long, are extremely cold hardy, and very low maintenance. 